Well, a well-known dance program is closing in Waukesha. The director of Extreme Dance is retiring. TMJ Forrest, Megan Lee, she was at the studio tonight where dancers and their parents got to soak in the studio one last time. After 16 years, Sandy Feller is closing the doors here at Waukesha Extreme Dance. The years have been filled with tragedy and triumph. My daughter loves dancing and it's because of her. Trista Jerling and her daughter Catalin have been a part of the Extreme Dance family for nearly eight years. They have been there for the good times. Over the years, the girls established friendships. You become closer. Some of the, you know, girls became family. The parents became, you kind of became family. They have also leaned on one another during the bad times. The dance team became victims of the horrible Waukesha Christmas Parade tragedy. There's a lot of anger and grief, but as time goes on, you just you kind of move on and you're never going to forget what happened. It left many of them seriously injured and forever impacted. When I joined, there was still like trauma in some of the girls heads. Abigail said the girls persevered. We even got to interview Sandy and her dancers back in 2022 when they prepared for the parade once again. If you're having a rough day, dance it out. And that's exactly what they did. It's been the best experience. For moms like Heather Bogey, she's grateful the studio instilled confidence in her daughter Isla. But she loves to perform and Sandy gave her that opportunity. Isla now has a trophy almost as big as her to remember the place that made her fall in love with dance. It's definitely something in her and and uh, the coaches and Sandy really brought that out so it could shine. Parents tell me it's the end of an era. It's, it's sad, but you know, all good things come to an end. Now it's time for the dancers to take a bow. In Waukesha, Megan Lee, TMJ4 News.